Hi, my name's Patricia, I'm an artist, and I'm going to show you how to draw an upright vacuum. First, I start with the handle. Just draw a nice a little curve line, depending on how you want the handle to look. And then you bring it down to the vacuum bag, which is usually a long rectangle. It doesn't have to be that, you know, that intricate. Just a nice rectangle will do. You can always add an extra line to give it a little dimension. And that brings it down to the part of the vacuum that cleans up the mess, what I like to call the mouth. That's not the technical term for it, but you know what I mean. And this kind of looks like, you know, some curved lines here down to a nice long rectangle. And then after that, you have an upright vacuum, and you can add some detail. A circle here, you know, maybe there's some kind of little gauge or whatever to, that tells you if the bag is full or not. And then here you can add, you know, something else, maybe a little fan part or whatever. You can shade it in. You know, just trick out your vacuum. Make it look like it's really fun to vacuum. There you go. So there you have an upright vacuum. Now you can always, I almost forgot, you can also add a little thing, you know, for those little corners where you need a more, a smaller little suction piece. You can add that if you want to get fancy. And um, that looks like about all. We've got the ground over here. And, um, you know, you can add a little, some lines to make it look like it's moving. And, um, you know, if you really want to get smart with it, a power cord. So there you go. There's your vacuum. Enjoy. Mm -hmm.